Hark! What is that in the distance? Mm. Something is coming. No, take it away. Oh man, it's getting really close. Kill it. Hi there, how's it go? Wait, what are you doing? I warned you, bro. And then everyone had seizures. Hey everyone, welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Yellow Version. Hey. I am Ray, and I am joined by my lovely friend Cal. How are you doing? Also, so yeah, fuck Pikachu, but this game's great. So yeah, Pokemon Yellow was literally the very first Pokemon game I've ever played, and I have so many fond memories of this wonderful, wonderful game. I just felt like playing it all of a sudden, because I've been doing some drawing lately. Yesterday, uh, trying to stream Pokemon Emerald, and I was drawing Hilda on the side. Not for the Pokemon White LP, just wanted to draw her for fun. And it just felt, just felt like I'm in a Pokemon mood, so I was like, yeah, fuck it, I'll just play some Pokemon. And I brought Cal along, because he's cool. Yeah, I also have fond memories of, uh, well, Pokemon in general, Gen 1. I mean, I started with Red, I believe. Um, and then I got Blue, and then I got Yellow. So I, I played all the Gen 1 games, and don't worry, I for I don't think any either of us are, like, particular Gen 1ers. Like, we, we like all the games, more or less. More or yeah. less, well, maybe not all of them, but... Gen 4 is a little suspect, but yeah, I, I like Gen 1. Yeah, uh, Gen 1 is nice. I mean, it has its fair share of problems, a list of which both of us have in front of us, but we'll get to that when we, uh... Yeah, that, when, we get when, to that, that. when that is relevant. So, the start of a new game, and hey, look there! Who's this dapper young, young man? I don't know, man. Seems to be getting on in years. Dapper young man. Oh no, that used to be, uh... Was it a Nidoran, or...? Yeah, I think it, it was a female Nidoran. Yeah, Nidoran female that was like... Or a Nidorina! I think it was a Nidorina, actually. Yeah, but either way, it, it wasn't Pikachu, but... Yeah, I'm gonna put aside my irrational hatred of Pikachu, because, you know, like, he's a required... Well, not required, but... Well... Hey, Cal, what's our name? Ooh... Ah, uh, well, are we going to go full anime and call him Ash, or... I mean, because yeah, that's the, the thing about you're Yellow. You're the special guest. You can... This, yeah, Pokemon Yellow is based off of the anime. When it was based in Japan, it was, like, most of the way through. The anime was most of the way through, so that's what the, this version is based off of. Oh, hold on a minute. How many characters are you allowed? I want to say five to seven. I, it's usually seven for names. Uh, try a new name, because I think I've got something. Seven. Please, 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 hold on. I got this. Yeah, that's seven. So, um, type this in for me one by one, Ray. Okay. R. I. T. C. Ah, oh, shit. H. I. Yeah, you know how it is. Yeah, boy. <laughs> it begins. Oh shit! Now who do we? Oh my god. Oh shit! So are we gonna rival. are we gonna fuck with this so hard? <laughs> so A S. <laughs> fuck it, Gary. <laughs> yeah, Gary. It, it can't be anyone else, really. This guy's not blue. Not he's not blue yet. Now we're gonna play as a successful enemy Pokemon train. Yeah! And he's completely nuanced character and not a Mary Gary Sue at all. Nah, no, I'm okay. I actually kinda like Richie. Did he also lose, by the way? I don't think he did he. He, lo like he lost immediately after Ash did, rip him. Yeah. But he he was he still is better, so let's go. Richie's adventure. What you got there, man? My oh, SNES! It's time yeah, but, to go. But what was he playing? I I was it Mario Super Picross? I mean Fucking Cal Cal! Freaking nerdy ass shit. Where's my potion? Oh yeah, the free potion. Neat. Hey mom, I'm gonna go off a journey, gonna I'm gonna talk to you never. Uh It said so on TV. Mom, I'm ten years old. Uh huh. That's a reference to a real life movie. I better go too. Hail friends, welcome to Pallet Town and all its uh, white and blue terror. Yeah, there there is something wrong here. Oh man. That's the Protect thing, right? me, squires! Like you can 
Ooh, shades of your journey await. Oh, uh, classic. Yeah. A classic. So Pallet Town has three buildings. One of them being my house, one of them being my rival's house, come of the universe, and one of them being the big man's house. Yeah. Thing is, that never really changes, does it? I mean, until like Gen 5-ish, all Pokemon cities are like 10 buildings or less. Well, except for a couple of instances. Most starter towns are pretty desolate, aren't they? So, it's just a standard day for Richie, who's just gonna casually walk out, no biggie. Oh shit! What's that? That was you close, you mean close. you were close? You were close. What's this? This is supposed to happen? Welcome back. Oh Sounds. no. It's happening. What would have happened if Professor Oak tried to fight? <laughs> <laughs> Just totally decked the shit out of Pikachu. It's like, come here. I could think I had this Pokeball handy. Huh. But we weren't even moving. Pokemon only appear when we move. Or at least turn around, yeah. I know! I just had a Pokeball on me for no reason. Dude, he probably has quite a many on his person. Why are you dragging me here? Oh, hey. Aw, oh, shit, it's Gary Oak. He's impatient, he's impatient little shit. He's gonna get, he's gonna get precisely what he deserves. Wow, technology's incredible! Sweet, oh, yeah. Freeman. What about me? Sweet, I'm gonna, look, I'm gonna look around first. It's encyclopedia like, but the pages are blank. Push short to open the menu. You don't say! Hey, look! I. 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 The. Uh. Oh. Nope. Damn it. GG no re. The save option is on the menu screen. You don't say! I can actually do that. Check this out. Player Richie! Saving. That's so cool. Yeah. It's like, it's a new feature, man. By the way, this is what we look like. Wow, what are all those heads down there? Oh, Jesus, Mr. Question Mark down there. Is it but Sturm again? I bet you it's Sturm again. <laughs> it's probably Sturm. Fucking Sturm. God damn it, Sturm. Alright, time to take this Pokeball. Hey, what the hell? Shreked. Gary, special no. Pokemon! Happy he took banter. arguably a better Pokemon because it has tons of options. Spoilers. Uh, mm. But yeah, just what did he pick up? He's just like, save that for me! No, just let his grandson have it. <sighs> Alright, old well. man, you better not dick me around. Literally just the one he caught earlier. I always wanted a rat! So yeah, Pikachu is part of my team, always. I've never taken it out of my party whenever I put Pokemon on yellow. Uh, so, uh, Cal, uh, Cal, I give Ryu name to, Rain to name it. Well, we are Richie, so... You know what to do. I suppose. I suppose it's only fitting. Yeah. Sparky. Cheers and all that. So yeah, we have Sparky. And the, and the very, very low quality voice bites by Ikue Otani. Oh yeah, they they are... Ooh. Which, I, hey. which I thought was the coolest fucking thing back in, back in the day. I was like, holy shit, that's really cool. It was pretty cool back then. So we try to leave and... Guy was oh. like, you fucking shit, don't you dare ignore me. Not to this shit again. This shit again. And now it's time for our first battle! Doop. It's Gary. Gary wants to fight. And his Pokemon is... Eevee! Eevee. Fucking casual! It's the battle of the Gary Stew Pokemon! It's happening. So yeah, it's, a, it's pretty much a straight fight. 
Eevee beats the shit out of you with its tackle, you shock it to shit with its other shock. Yeah, but if he keeps attacking you outright, you stand to lose, don't you? Yes, you do. And, uh, you losing here actually does affect something in Pokemon Yellow. It does, actually, yeah. That's right. I'd almost forgotten about that myself. But you But he is a screw and loses. Destroyed. Being that, well, I can get you a starter level. And I get Tail Whip. Pikachu's moveset is entirely different from Yellow version from Red and Blue. Yeah, they really, they needed to expand it a bit in order to make up for, uh... The fact that he's, you know, your starter. Okay. Isn't that just how it always works? Yeah, you go do that, Gary. Theme song plays. The fuck? That's <laughs> Oak. What? Oh, not a this to shit thought again. Oh, great. Wow, features. Yeah, so uh, in a precursor to the friendship feature that will be later featured in this Gen 2, your Pikachu comes out of this Pokeball and follows you. And he hates your guts! He's fucking mad. <laughs> Let's fix that. So there's an exploit you can do. Just constantly give it a potion while it's at full HP. This will add to its friendship. I didn't actually know that one. That's marvelous. Yeah, that's a few times. Just like, that's it, no, 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 not not gonna give you it, no. Now he's modestly, modestly happy. The highest one is where he blinks, right? Uh, he just jumps over with a heart on his head. Oh, I see. So yeah, good old Pallet Town, time to leave. Never yeah, leave. We've, we've, we've seen more... All the buildings, so... Okay. Friends, welcome to Route 1, where journeys Whoa. begin and, uh, palettes change. Col color shift there, uh. So, uh, we just confirmed that Kanto is an alternate dimension where, where reality is warped and space is bendable. Glitch City, though. Oh, Glitch City is the fucking best. Can you even pull that off in yellow? I- I think you can do Glitch City in yellow? I think. Yeah, talk to this guy, he gets you a potion. Wow, potion to store 20 HP, that's so cool. It is! No, not really, it's, it's it's never been good. Except early game though, don't worry. So anyway, uh, Route 1, should I go over the essentials here? Please do, Cal! That's why you're here. I'm just kidding. Oh. Anyway, um, you got a potion to get from a certain person here, as you know. Um, uh, the encounter rates are slightly different from Red and Blue. 70% Pidgey, 30% Rattata. Level 2 to 7, and 2 to 4 on the Rattata. Oh, that's nice. That's hey, about all you're getting. Hey look, it's a Pidgey. I usually get a Pidgey. Not this time, Cal's decided my team in this playthrough. Well, partially. Did, um, does, uh, you know whose suggestion of Fero still apply? Yeah, um, maybe. We might, we might see. Cause I, I don't, I don't dislike Fero, so I, I'm uh, Neither do I, that. so yeah, I'm, I'm okay with that. But yeah, I already suggested that we're gonna, we're gonna keep Squirtle. Yeah, so we got Pikachu Squirtle. I've got my own favorite, but we'll keep that quiet until the time comes. Um, but otherwise... Oh, when do we get that Pokemon anyway? Let's see. Uh, according to this, according to my lovely Bulbapedia... Route 5. Neat. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Oh lord, all these- so Yeah, welcome to a Pokemon yeah. Center. They heal your Pokemon nice and tip-top for no money. Because if they ran a business, well, you'd be fucked. Yeah. Also, look, that's what appears to be a Chansey. Yes, indeed. And what vaguely looks like a Nurse Joy. Also, that little thing over there behind her is where she puts Pikachu in a Pokeball. Yeah, by force that she has to put a Pikachu in a Pokeball just so you can get healed. So kind! PC wow. in the corner. I wonder if that'll become a trend, even where it should not tread. Hmm. Oh, someone. Someone? Oh god, this I shit. I can print my box. There are no Pokemon here. Withdraw, deposit, move was not allowed. 
I love how they still have the withdrawn deposit options now, and it's just obsolete. It's been obsolete since Gen fucking 3. Yeah. Yes, please indulge me. I am a stupid idiot. I don't know shit about Pokemon. No. Oh. Cool. It's Poison Jab. So yeah, Viridian City, your first town. It's very quaint, simple. You gotta yeah. go here. I know yeah. prof folk. That's a beautiful thing, thank you. Oh, it's dubious parcel. We never know what's inside that thing. So the custom you say this is a custom Pokeball, but mmm. Paralyz heels. Oh Paral the abbreviation. Paralyz heels. They didn't fix that until Gen 6, did they? No, along with various other ones, I believe. Green City, the eternally green paradise. Hmm. I didn't think much of Viridian City when I first played. I was just like, oh wow, I'm on my journey. This is so cool. Oh god. What the fuck? Oh Jesus, not this guy. You can't go through here. This is private property. I love how he's just lying there. He just psychically pushes you back. Like, okay. With sheer force of. Drunkenness? <laughs> Sheer force, that's his ability. Four generations behind. Oh, oh, he hasn't had his coffee. I see. Uh huh, uh huh. Okay. Sure. I believe you. I bet he does, little kid. Yeah, kid, a lot of people like God of War. Oh, whoops, too early for that. Way too early for that. God, you gotta pace yourself. Spiro, name Spiri. That's... Wow, that's a very clever, original name. You guys are masters at this sort of shit. I remember when I was, like, young, my Pokemon nicknames weren't that imaginative. What's this? I just went fucking lowercase fucking because the all cats bothered me to shit. Yeah. Those poke balls at your waist. Oh, that's, that's, that's really convenient, man. You gotta keep them trapped in their, their small cages for all time. For all time. So there's a nice, nifty little glitch involved when you get Oak's Parcel in back in red and blue. Uh, see, if you actually evolved your starter by grinding all over and over again before you bring it back to him, uh, Press Oak will give you the Pokedex, but the game would freeze because the game would rec uh, register the evolved Pokemon with your starter. And the game would actually lock up and you would have to start all over again. Destroyed. I don't actually know about that one either. Yeah, they partially fixed it for yellow version, but there's a special way around it, but I don't remember how it, how it goes. Also, uh... Haven't really gone over this much yet, have we? The, um... The sprites. Yeah, the sprites. In, uh... Red and green, they were... <clears throat> very good. And then red and blue, they got slightly better, but oh god, the tongue. Yeah. We all remember the tongue. Blue version was in recent Japan. They fixed up a bunch of the sprites a little bit. This is this was before the time the anime took off, and by the time Yellow did, that, that's when the anime did take off. And the front sprites started to resemble the Pokemon a lot more. Not so much the back ones, though. Oh yeah, they are still very much as uh, unique as they've ever been. I mean, look at Pikachu. He's fat as fuck. He's also fucking glowing. Look at him. It's like he's like he's got. He's like he's going Super Saiyan any moment. Although mind you, Pikachu's design back then was still pretty fat. Now it's become yeah, slightly become taller. Very taller tall and slender. slender. Like he used to be short and fat. Like you know, a oh, mouse. Oh, yeah, he would have been fucking plump as shit. Pikachu was slow down on the Poke Blocks, my friend. Yeah. But yeah, the, the sprites in this game are really well made, from the front ones anyway. Yeah, they are really well well done as far as being on the Game Boy are considered. It took, them, it took them four years to get their shit together, but hey, small steps. This was what, like, barely any time before Gold and Silver came to pass? 99. Like 99, yeah. uh, since uh, Gen 2 started to come out a year later. 
Pokemon was an odd phenomenon, as I said in my introduction in my uh, introduction forward to Pokemon White LP. Uh, I didn't know Pokemon was uh, an RPG or a JRPG. Like the like the, yeah. the smallest hints of G being a JRPG that I had before Pokemon was playing uh, a very small portion of Super Mario RPG. And then I didn't even know. I just thought RPG was kind of lame and stupid and dumb until I. Until I played uh, Final Fantasy VIII with my friend. Oh, sh whoa, whoa, hold on, wait. Final Fantasy VIII? Yeah, Final Fantasy VIII was my first legitimate JRPG. Although, I had played Paper Mario earlier than that. Like, a ye like about a year earlier, and I beat that in like three days. But I didn't realize that was a traditional JRPG, too. Well, is it really? I mean... Mm, I, don't re I don't really count as a traditional JRPG, but yeah, that's the thing. But yeah, it just took me a while. But Pokemon really took off with me. Cause, oh, yeah. I don't know. Well, there's a reason it took off as a big cultural phenomenon. It, I mean, it it really was unlike anything anyone had seen on a console, well, on any like video game before. That the scope of it and the whole monster collecting thing had never been done so in depth beforehand. And that's what really, uh, what really turned people onto it, I suppose. Hey, yeah, how are I, you doing? Because I gave it a bunch of potions and it said no, but it still liked me anyway. A. Mm. This is for you. Hope it's not something vile or something forbidden that we shouldn't speak of. Oh, this is the custom Pokeball I ordered. It's the GS Ball. No, please. It's the GS Ball. No. The forbidden technique, the GS Ball. We promise never to mention it again. It's being mentioned. We're richy right now. It is the GS Ball. So yeah, and then Gary, there's this asshole. Gary just bamps right right in. He's like, hey guys, what's up? Pokedex. In this version, it's literally just a book. Yeah, it, it's just a book. It's, it's like electronic, but it's just a book. Yeah. An electronic book? Well, not quite an e-book. That was I, my dream, and instead I, I'm gonna have children to do it for me. Yeah! <laughs> Become back and see me in 50 years. Welcome back. Is what I hope to say to you after you've completed my life stream. <laughs> Suddenly Gary returns with 149 like in Pokemon Origins. You are close! God damn it! Anyway. <laughs> Richie. So glad we were able to fit that. Oh, I'm sorry, sister? Oh, nice. Bro, you have a sister? That's not can it! Lel. How you doing? It's canon to the games, but... <laughs> this isn't the games, bro. This is the anime. This or is not really. To, this is supposed to... Yeah. It's it, kind it's of... The, and it, hybrid, yeah. It kind of goes back and forth between the two, so yeah. Gary has a sister, because Blue has a sister in the original games. Hey, hey there, Daisy. Hey, aren't you supposed to be Misty's sister? Well, whatever. I got a town map! Hey. Alright, so that's Palatown. We'll just leave that behind. And will he never speak of Palatown ever again? Yeah, we literally have no reason ever to come back. Well, maybe as thoroughfare, but... More on that later. More battle. More battle. Much later. It's you. It's you. Oh well, I say the sprites are really good. I mean, some of the color palettes are a bit off. Ratata is definitely not purple. No, not purple. Very... It's very gray. I mean, otherwise the detail is fine. And then, then again, this game wasn't really made with color with the Game Boy Color in mind, because, you know, you can still play it normally. Oh, yeah. Alright, so how long are we recording? Hello, Randy Cam, tell me. 24 minutes, yeah, we can, anyway, For this, I'm just gonna keep going until we feel like we're gonna stop. Because Pokemon is just a game we can sit down and just play instead of just recording in chunks like I did with Gaiden or whatever, another game. Yeah, go on as we mean to. Um, alright, so... 
Oh, you can get a Mankey near here, can't you? Yes, you can. They added this in for yellow version because Brock because, is a shit. Mm, yeah, Brock, going at him with the fucking Pikachu. Hold on a minute. Uh, I need to get the next route ready. So right now we're on Route 22. Very well then. Don't really Let's... have to come here for anything really important. Just catch some really weak sauce Pokemon. Like, Spiro. Spiro. Yep, he's got a 10% chance of appearing. Um, along with Rattata, 10%. Nidoran female, 25%. Need ran male, 35%, and. Mankey. Mankey. 20%. Hey! Uh, otherwise, you've got fishing, but that's not relevant to us right now, so never mind. But just in case you were curious, Magikarp, Poliwag, Goldeen, Poliwhirl. What? Well, see, if you're a new player, you should definitely catch a Mankey. Definitely, definitely. Or a Nido Ran. Oh, and yeah. look, Thunder Wave level 8! You're not supposed to learn that! Oh, wow! I, I just realized I have no Pokeballs to my name. We should fix that. Mm. Nice going. Uh, but yeah, no worries. <laughs> Thanks, Cal. It's okay, love you, really. Can you help me? Give me five of these. One for each of my slaves. I mean, I said nothing of the sort. You're crazy. Mm. Ten. Ten antidote. I am balling in this shit. You better know it. Yeah, burn antidotes. He burn oh, heal yeah. is not relevant right now. Fucking ten percent chance will fucking say no. Nah. So we gotta get used to the twenty items limit again. Oh shit. Oh yeah, 20 separate items. Yeah, just 20 flat. So I'm just gonna keep going with Pikachu until Cal stops me and say, Hey, you should catch this Pokemon. Speaking of being interrupted... Hey! Uh... Well, no, you dipshit. Haha, <laughs> I'm betting Gary speaks from experience. It's just like, hey, let me in. So, time for another battle. This one is entirely optional. Yeah. Shit, like son, that's a, a Spiro. That's a Spiro. And gonna, trained it. I'm gonna live a bit vicious there. Sid Vicious over here. Oh my goodness. Oh! Mm -mm -mm. Ooh. <laughs> I'll see you in the afterlife. In the Cold War, my friend. Goodbye. Uh, now you're probably gonna get fucked. Yeah, his EV is... His starter is always one level lower than the Pokemon he just freshly caught. Oh, never mind, he's an idiot. You should probably have this. Yep. Oh, that beautiful AI sticking to one move and then it's just like, oh fuck, I fuck everything else, I don't need that shit. Oh, oh never mind! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ooh, I don't know if we're gonna make it. Oh no, man, no. Was that a crit? That was not a crit. Oh no, oh no. Oh man, you, it's as low as it can go. No, I, think really? it, I think it just flat out missed, because uh, moves have a 99.6%- Oh Ooh. shit! Uh. I might- I might- I'm level 9. Oh, I won. nice. Thank god I won. Because if I lost here, I would have gotten the, his Eevee to become, uh, Flareon. And even he doesn't deserve that. Like, jeez. Well, four. Alright, jeez. Almost beat my Pikachu half to shit, but okay. Doesn't even jump down. Fucking casual. So yeah, as I said, uh, beating if you uh, depending on what you did with the Gary fights in the the first two, will change his EV later on in later fights. If you 
lose the first fight and either lose the second or skip the second, you will, his Eevee will become a Vaporeon. If you win the first fight or lose the second or skip the second, his Eevee will become a Flareon. And if you win both fights, his Eevee will become a Jolteon. Basically, whatever is strong or weak to Pikachu. Yeah, essentially this. It's, it's kind of interesting that they did that. 